Right, I just found it on switch. Remind me again how much the grant was for? 130,000. Okay. And uh, last week I signed uh, an order for about £100,000, which was uh, quite enjoyable. And, what's, and what, what do you get for that? Uh, what we get is some fluorescence optics, which will go on this machine. So I can just open this up. Uh, this is the inside of a uh, centrifuge. And what happens is that you'll get a rotor like this. And into here goes a cell. And these cells are transparent, like this, so you can see all the way through. And they sit in here. So as this spins around, there's some kind of detection goes on. So you can observe what happens to this at high speeds. And this tells us all the wonderful stuff about um, size and shape of macromolecules. Uh, and it's quite a very, very efficient way. This is the hydrodynamics bit. Um, and what we're going to do is basically have a large big block here, which is the fluorescence optics, which will basically have a laser which shoots down and will observe the fluorescence that comes off um, which it bounces back up and we're able to look at lower and lower concentrations. Um, so the sort of interactions we see here are reasonably weak um, for the scientists among you on the micromolar scale. Uh, we can observe because of our optical system, we can observe protein nucleic acid interactions a lot, lot tighter and we'll be able to actually use the fluorescence optics to actually look at these much, much tighter interactions. Uh, which is, will be completely unique. This will be the second one in the UK and the first one that's actually publicly available to the UK community to come here and actually use. So we're very excited about that. Of course, uh, we've also got a grant in naturally for, uh, put another grant in for a postdoc to come and actually be able to actually use this and actually train, actually develop the methodology. But again, you never know. They will fund the equipment, but not the people. So it may well be me actually running this again. <laughs> So that's, that's nice. We ha we'll, we'll have these wonderful uh, things. And uh, we've also bought um, seven of these little cells, which are about $1,600 a piece, which um, at the present uh, pound dollar rate works out very favorably for us, <laughs> indeed. Um, still seem pretty pricey to me, mate. <laughs> 800 pounds a piece, absolutely. Um, but they're all sort of completely bespoke um, um, hand, almost handmade instruments. Um, so for £800, it's actually not bad at all. And you've got to remember that when these things spin at 60,000 RPM, they're experiencing a force of around a quarter of a million times gravity. So one gram equals a one quarter of a tonne. So they, you know, you've got to be, have good components there. <laughs>